Welcome back, gang gang. It's going to be a quick little message. Um, The reason why I'm saying this is because too many people is like, what is America going to do for Brittany Griner? Um, This is going to be my last video on her, unless the most high tell me to do something. But um, don't nobody give a fuck, okay? obviously nobody gives a fuck that's not something that we should be stressing it's people over here that's starving you know it's people that ain't got no place to go um it's kids that's getting molested you know it's far more important shit the little helper went over there supposedly because I, I believe it's all fake but she went over there with some weed she knew she shouldn't have been going over there with that goddamn weed but the reason why I made this video is because if anybody should be doing something, it should be the gay community. Y'all be on every set, y'all be on every scene, but you're not on this scene. Y'all ain't made no gay pride march, you ain't did nothing for her. If anybody gonna fight for her, it need to be her own kind. At the end of the day, y'all be want equal rights, front center shit, y'all be screaming, doing all this other shit. Fight for your people. Fight for your motherfucking people. Don't nobody come over here and talk about, oh, the black people need to know, not the black community. Because last time I checked, sh she don't look like me. And in fact, that ain't even a woman. That's a man. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. The, 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 you can't even believe half the shit you see on TV. Most of these motherfuckers was made in a fucking lab. Test tube babies. Um, Anywho... That beside the point, my main message was this, because the most I said, if anybody should be fighting for her, screaming for her, being on TV, doing marches, it's the uh, alphabet people. And I said, what, GPD, LYPD, you know, LAPD, NYPD, I said LAPD, I said that, they said no, alphabet, oh, the LGBT community, y'all need to be fighting for her. Where y'all at? I ain't seen not one march, not one, not, I, I ain't seen a rainbow. I ain't heard nothing. Like y'all main gay people that's in the, that's in the press and shit. I ain't heard none of them even speak on her. You know, I ain't gonna call them, you know, well, we got uh, the dude who seen, um, the old town road. He ain't spoke. D-Wade's daughter, Zaza, Saucy Santana. Um, who else is sweet out there? Well, let me start calling you hard, you hardcore rappers out. Like P Diddy, he ain't, well, he ain't hardcore. P Diddy, cause he's sweet as hell. Why ain't you speaking up for her? all these rappers that like to get done in their butt? Why ain't y'all speaking up for Britney? Yeah, you'll be surprised. Your favorite rapper, favorite rapper, gay. Why ain't y'all speaking up for Brit Bread? The most I said, quit asking people in America. I see Lil Boosie said something for her, but the, I, I fuck with Lil Boosie. You know, Lil Boosie keeps it real, and I'm keeping it real too. The bitch knew what it was. Therefore, nobody care. It's my last time speaking on her, unless the most I tell me to. She, she shouldn't have did what she did. It like if I stand up to march or fight for her, or speak on her, you know, speak for her, then I might as well speak for the people that's in my damn city. You feel me? That's fighting weed charges, whether they in a different country or not, they still fighting weed charges. Like, baby, get over it. You should have known not to take that shit to them people places. Whether it was a weed pen, vape pen, actual weed, you should have motherfucker ready to fire print before you took your dusty ass over there. You thought because you was a super, I uh, met a superstar in America that you would be a superstar over there. You're not. At the end of the day, next all Americans gonna learn from Britney. Um, read the rules and the regulations before you take your ass outside of your country, outside of America. Make sure you follow all rules and guidelines so this don't happen to you. She was, the most I said, she was an example to show y'all what is, what is fair or what is allowed in America is not allowed outside of America. And once you step your dusty ass outside of America, Whatever rules that they have will be placed upon your ass. It don't matter who the fuck you is. So with that being said, 
the uh pride little gay community whoever if y'all should be the only people out there fighting for brit brit nobody's going to fight for her and as you can see if the lgbt community ain't fighting for her, what makes you think we're gonna fight for her? exactly her own people ain't even helping her and these people be on every scene i'm telling you they be everywhere but i'm gonna go ahead and end this little message right there because i ain't gonna run it longer i'm just saying hey shout out to the LGBT community, y'all need to holler at your girl, not me, Brittany Griner. I don't swing that way. I'm heterosexual, and I wouldn't damn stop, and I don't give a fuck who get mad. I wouldn't even motherfucking slide for an LBT community. I wouldn't step. I wouldn't do none of that shit, because that's not me. I'm heterosexual. If you want me to step or, or stand tall for something... Um, let it be some heterosexual where they got man and one man, then I'm out there front center. Outside of that, I ain't stepping for shit that I don't do. That that's insanity. Um Collect them. Sending you nothing but love, peace, abundance, wealth, and joy, healing and protecting energy, man. Metamorsai. Metamorsai be with you, within you, and surrounding you. I would say may the most high be with Brittany Grinder, but the most high said, ah, 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 ah. no, no, no. All right, later, Gators.